This is world's strongest man, Mitchell Hooper. With previously defeating elite athletes like Brian Shaw and Tom Stoltman, he'll be taking me through his exact workout that makes him the world's strongest man. All right, we're getting into the workout. World's strongest man. Listen, he might have some size on me, but at least I have Gorilla Mind, Code Jesse. Listen, I'm a pump chaser. I don't know if the pump matters, but I'm getting one. Wow, that's big. I wish my girlfriend said the same. What are we doing and so, why? So in strongman, we got no rules, right? You just oh. do what you gotta do. Your goal is gonna be get the bar from here onto my belt. Okay. On the belt, then you have to thrust it up to your chest. Okay, there, then okay, you can go. easy money. Okay, there we go. Wow, that was some ease. Ease right there. Ease. Wow. And the world's strongest man, Mitchell Hooper, 2024. If you deadlift it and stop, all your momentum is done, right? Okay. Literally go from the ground, fast deadlift up to the belt. Okay. When you're up at the belt, <laughs> chill. Your energy's too much. Put it down. When you get up to the belt, two options. Either you're here or pull it up and flip it. Okay. Yeah. So, like, I can even go. Yeah. So that's what I do. It's, I find it that. Pinches easy. my skin. Yes. <laughs> See? <laughs> <laughs> what you looking at? Go slightly wider hands. Okay. Because right now, when it sits up off of you, and it's up here, when you go to dip and drive, as soon as you drive, that sinks down into your hands, it becomes twice as heavy. Okay. So see if you can go wider, okay. and you can get it right up in here. Okay. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah. Good. Go down to your shoulders, rest it on your shoulders. Yeah. Now from there, launch it with your legs. Lightweight, baby. Let's see it. He's got a belly for it. Easy. Jesus Christ. What's your max overhead press if you were to just do barbell? Push press? Yeah. I've done 485. That's some Larry What's wheels. Your max? My max deadlift is 485. <laughs> this is going to be a disaster. <laughs> this is not happening. <laughs> Jesse, momentum. So deadlift, you're Whoa. thinking like rip it from the ground. Yep. Here, you're thinking like you want an acceleration. OK. Oh, and so okay, look okay. up, get the tension, have the bar start to come up, and okay. try and explode as it passes your knee. Oh. <laughs> come on. We're 40 kilos off working weight. Come on! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Amazing. What do you, you want another plate? Another 45, yeah. Mitchell's at 315 right now. You know, I couldn't get the 225. I'll probably go for like a 185. My next set. A little more modest. I, I forgot to chalk, that's why. Yeah, the strongman bit that we're missing. Oh, that's why I didn't get it. That's not a bad <laughs> That's right, baby. Can I butter your belly? Yeah, baby, go Come for it. Come here, boy. Oh, no war paint. There we go. By the end of this weekend, you might be my on-call coach. Come on! Holy crap, holy crap. Easy for him. Get it up, get it up. Easy. Oh. If you just go before I see you. Get your elbows, get your shoulders up. Yeah, there you go. Pop it. Come on, come on. What are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, I suck, I suck. <laughs> How did that happen though? Bro, I don't know. <laughs> I was like this. So good. I know what it was. My wrist went like that. Yeah. And then when I went like this, my pinky was stuck. <laughs> but I got it up. It's good, man. It's really good. It's a lot of technical skill and practice. So it matters, your form, way more than just getting the weight up. There we go. Easy. Go! Go ahead. Okay, hold on, come here. I need a little. You see, you got better as you went. Most definitely a different kind of tired. It's like my whole body's fatigued rather than just one muscle when I do bodybuilding. 
Are you a plate in or plate out type of guy? Okay, okay doesn't care. Wait, wait for him. That's freaking heavy. Ball now. He gets it on his belly. Oh, it's on his shoulders. Come on, come on, you got this. You got this, easy, good. Oh, that was the best one yet. Oh, he's going, oh my God, he's going for another, okay. The big baby goes for a second. Struggles a little on his belly. Gets it up to his shoulders. Can he do it? The whole gym is watching. Holy sh There we go. Okay. Exercise number one. Complete. So you bring this every time you go to the gym? Yeah. A luggage? Yeah. <laughs> it's such a hassle, but it's like, it's so many things where if you don't have the right kit, you're like, your numbers will be 10% off what they were yep. supposed to be. Then like, Over time that adds up. So I, I never, my muscles part. never get sore. My really? joints get sore. But that's why we start up on the wall, nice deep breaths, let the nervous system come down. Wow. Then you'll build it back up into doing stuff. Okay. And then after you're done working out, back to the wall, try and bring the nervous system back down. Next one, we're gonna grab Atlas Stone. Okay, you and, want this one? Uh, sure. <laughs> Thanks, man. <laughs> now, the goal is like, get it from there, okay. up to your shoulder. Okay. Bang! Okay, so okay. first step is just get it to your lap. From okay. here we sit, you hug it, and then we roll it up our body to our shoulder. Okay. Now, most common error, is when you're here, you try to like throw it and like catch it. Yep. But we don't, we never want hands to be off. Okay. So you're gonna throw up your body, catch it with the bottom one, top one stays on, and you can move one okay. hand at a time. It's kind of small, you know. <clears throat> no problem. All right, let's see, let's see the big man do it. Let's see a professional. Okay. It must be like really light. Okay. Holy yeah, simple as that. It's just like that easy. As simple as that. As simple as that, okay. okay. Now, important, couple of important things. One, you really think you're I can gonna try. Up. I don't. No. <laughs> what are you trying to do this to me? You want your forearms okay. to be up in contact with the stone there. Okay. And your hands to be slightly in front. Okay. okay but so I'm here. Squeeze your forearms. Oh, it's rolling, it's rolling. Get back. Okay, now squeeze your forearms into the ball. Go! Yeah! Now what? Shit Get your myself. hands over top. Okay, good. Now shoot your hips underneath. Get your hips under the ball. Uh, roll it on. Pretty good though. I got it. That was pretty good. I think I popped something down down there. The, one of the boys just went. Uh -uh. Let's see. Let's see you do another. There we go. Good work. Good work. Ooh. Holy hell. Oh. He's just casual about it, bro. <laughs> bro, that's terrifying. Let's roll this out of the way. You don't want to try. God, no. There you go. Oh, my God. Yeah, yeah, go. Go, one more. Yeah, buddy. Woo! No broken back this time. You're coming for it. Let's go. Insane. that most people can't do is manipulate their spine. Most people want to be so stiff and rigid because that's what we're always taught. But in strongman, when you pick up a stone, like you're going to be folded over. Yeah. When you got something on your chest, you got to be folded back. So the spine mobility is something that's ah. really foreign to most people and it's a conditioning thing. So if I don't do log press for a while, I get back in a log where I'm like this a lot, my back will be pain. Do you have any slip discs? Yeah. Do you feel them? Not after they heal. Okay, okay. So this heal like everything else. Okay. Hell yeah. There you go. For anyone with back problems, get moving and don't listen to your doctor. <laughs> I'm joking. Just do whatever you want. I'm not responsible. All right, guys, so we're gonna be training thumbs. I thought you normally would train thumbs with a thumb war, but apparently you just grab a bar, squeeze your thumb, let it burn, baby. The way you get set is treat 
this webbing yeah, as like yeah. a trigger. So drive that in, your yeah. thumb will tuck under, and you'll be able to get your, your thumb with Whoa. these two fingers. Oh, it hurts. I don't like it. This is where men are made. 20, count out 20. Yeah, we'll do 20 second Three, holds. Four, five, six. I don't like it, seven, eight, ten. It feels like my thumb's gonna rip off. Yeah. 12, 13, 14, 15, 20. Wow, I do not like that one. So what I'm literally doing is I'm just, I'm grabbing my thumb. Instead of grabbing the ball like this, I'm tucking my thumb under, and when you pull, it puts all this pressure right on your thumb, and that's what we're training. I didn't know that people even do this, but. If your thumb is tucked in, there's no way for your hand to open yeah. unless you release. Unless you out. Yeah. Don't be a That's right. One, two, three. Do you feel it? Not yet. Not yet. A PR on this? No, not like this. But I've taken basically 300 kilos of combined stones for 30 meters. Oh, this sucks. This is torture. It is. Oh, three, ah, I don't like two, it. One, and good. Brother! This is 100 kilos. We're talking 300 kilos. And we're talking a ring with a diameter that's less than half of that. So here's what we need to do. We're gonna find a doctor. We're just gonna have to, we need to numb from here down. Well, I no, don't want to feel anything. No, here down, or else you wouldn't be able to feel uh, at least, At least the whole here. thumb I can't feel. I know. I'm sick of it. Here we go. Not too much. Yeah. <laughs> 20, let's go. So I laugh when I'm in pain yeah. because something in my brain, la uh, <laughs> dopamine and pain are really close of a feeling. Right. So for some people, like myself, we laugh when we're in pain. Right. <laughs> Bro, my thumb's absolutely destroyed. It feels like I literally took a lighter and just lit my thumb on fire while you're doing Horrible. it. This is my last one. That's right, baby. Come on, find the happiness. Find the happiness in the pain. Oh. Do some Wim Hof breathing. Good. Up. There we go. So you're telling me I gotta do this? I believe in you, Jesse. I believe in you. Tell you what, okay, I'll make you a deal. If you can hold it for 20, I'll add a plate and I'll do 500 pounds for 20. Deal. One, two, three. Six, 14, come on, 15, 16, 19, 20. Oh! My thumbs are skinny. Oh! He made a bet. You gotta own up to it. Five plates. And when you win this year, this is the moment that did it. Strongman training is just pain training. Literally, you're like, you go from pinching your stomach yeah. to like stone against your ear to crushing your thumbs. It's all so stupid. Really weird. <laughs> it's all so stupid. Yeah, ready? And go. One, two, three, four, five, 11, 12, 18, 19, 20. Down, bitch! That's right. That's a champion right there. That's a champion. Come on. Ladies and gentlemen, oh, we may not be able to yeah. type with our fingers anymore or wipe our butts. We did it one way or another with the world's strongest man. Make sure you guys go subscribe, all right? Well I'll link his stuff down below. Subscribe to me, and uh, check out our main channel video over on Jesse and West. I heard that guy's pretty cool. And don't forget to stay relentless.